morning you guys today is tuesday welcome back to the vlog i'm making breakfast i went to the gym this morning um it's been really hard to like get back on track with work and life because last week we did nothing like everything was closed canceled because of the storm so this time last week it was like snowing outside and we were just bundled inside and so it's just been really hard to like get back on track but Today was my first day back at the gym working out. You guys, I don't know what it is, but every time I drink a cup of coffee lately, I think about how during Ramadan, I'm not gonna be able to have my morning coffee. I don't know why Ramadan isn't in for another like over a month, but I just keep thinking about it and I'm just savoring and enjoying every cup that I have. And everyone always says like cut out caffeine a week or two before Ramadan starts so you don't go through like you know the headaches and stuff if anything i end up drinking more as it leads up to ramadan which is horrible which you should not do at all um and then just like going through horrible headaches and stuff like that when i am not drinking it but anyways i am making breakfast i'm boiling some eggs and i'm gonna make some avocado toast of course so i went to the store yesterday and grocery stores are well actually i went on sunday and the grocery store didn't have any bread milk um they had a lot of produce but not like everything and they didn't have any like yogurt or anything like that but i didn't i couldn't get any milk um i couldn't get any bread so I went to a different grocery store yesterday and I was able to get um, some milk and eggs and, and bread and stuff like that. I'm having Ezekiel bread, um, which I never normally get, but they, that's really kind of like all they had. So I don't mind it. It's okay. This is not a gluten-free bread, but it's Ezekiel flourless um, sprouted grain bread. what made me crave a boiled egg but i haven't had these in so long i used to eat these all the time in high school just like a quick breakfast um so i'm gonna eat this really quick so ignore this mess behind me but i wanted to show you guys my matching set i just got this is from h&m it's a pistachio color and it's so comfortable and i love wearing it around the house or even out like i would wear this with my air force ones and just wear it out so i'll link this down below if you guys want to check it out these sweatpants come in so many different colors and um they're super comfortable but this is the sweatshirt that matches with the pistachio color pants and I don't think I showed you guys on my YouTube channel my little makeup setup, so I'll show you after I do it. I'm gonna go get this beauty blender wet. So I love that I have this office, but the only thing that I don't like about it, well, two things. One is that it echoes in here, and two, my apartment where my unit is is right by the road so this you're gonna hear like cars driving by and i'm really sorry guys but just gotta work with what i have so i'm just gonna do like an everyday makeup look and um i am actually running some errands today and i just want to put some makeup on because i haven't worn makeup in like a week and more i just was such a slob kebab this past week so since we lost water last week, it wasn't that the pipes burst. It was that something happened at the main, I think the main water plant source, whatever, lost power. And so everyone in this area lost water and it came back for us Friday, like I told you guys, but we've been in a boil water alert notice for the past few days and that means any running water out of the sink you have to boil it before you can like drink it or cook with it or anything like that that's what we've been doing and any if you go to any grocery store they do not have any water i was at the grocery store yesterday all i could find was sparkling water so i got this huge thing of sparkling water and i'm drinking that right now but they just told us earlier today that you can use the water now we're not in a boiling water notice anymore but you have to let all of your faucets run for 15 minutes to kind of like flush out everything, I guess. 
and everybody's mad because they're like that water bills will be so high and you're the one who has to pay for it which <laughs> sucks i'm using the glossier cloud paint for blush on my cheeks and i have been obsessed with this i've used it well i've only used it once but i'm going to use it again today and i never use blush if you have fair skin you really can't use bronzer i don't know i personally can't i think because i have freckles and it just like looks weird on me but i have been trying to like experiment with more makeup and i have been using blush and this is a product that it's a cream product so really you just use your fingers and you can use like a beauty blender which i've been using as well and I don't have a mirror for my vanity here yet. I only have my phone, so that's what I'm using right now. Okay. You'll just blend it out, and then I'm gonna take my, oh my god, literally, the, what did I just do? This is why I don't wear that much makeup. <laughs> take the beauty blender and just blend it. Okay, that's how it looks, and I personally really like it. I think a little goes a long way, which I'm learning, um, but Glossier is a good brand to check out if you guys have not. It's not super expensive, and this product, the cloud paint, you can use it so many different ways. You can put it on your cheeks, you can put it on your lids, you can even put it on your lips if you wanted to. Um, so I love products that are like multi-use, which that is and then i'm gonna use a highlight so i like to put blush and then i'll put highlight on like the top of my cheekbone so i'm using hourglass and just a highlight brush shade silk and it's a little bit of a darker pink but i feel like with my skin tone it looks good um the other one was a little bit too pink for me so that is the final look and i will leave all the products down below if you guys want to check them out so here's my little vanity area that i added to my office this is actually a small desk but i love how it has these compartments it's perfect for a makeup area because the drawers are already like this you don't have to add any extra storage so i'm working on organizing this and then here is what the drawer looks like so i'll link this down below all right you guys i'm in the car i have a project today that i'm gonna tackle that i've been putting off for literally years <laughs> So my house, um, my parents' house, my room at my parents' house, I have not cleaned out. Like, um, my closet's a mess. Um, just like everything from high school, like trophies from dance team, all of my like, just a ton of stuff. Like I've been using it for storage and I haven't cleaned it out in forever. And my aunt from, um, north carolina is coming this weekend and she's gonna stay in my room so i'm using that as my motivation to clean everything out like make it nice for her and i need to go by target first to get some new pillows because the pillows at my in my room at my house are so flat i've been wanting to get some for myself if i stay the night there and i haven't so i'm gonna use this as an excuse like not an excuse but using it as my motivation to like get these things done Target. have to stock up on my favorite mousse in the hair aisle because I'm out. That's why my hair is up. So I always get the strength three and the totally twisted curl mousse. There are a bunch of different ones, but I always get the totally twisted one. I have not tried that one. Okay, now I'm gonna get pillows when it comes. When it comes to pillows, I'm very picky so I like mine to be like firm but soft so it's 
might take a while to find them. I usually get like one more expensive pillow that I'll sleep on that's like perfectly firm, um, soft, and then I'll just get like cheaper ones for surrounding pillows to like put around me when I sleep. Okay, got the pillows. Now I'm in the sheet section. This blanket is the one I have on my bed in my apartment. I'm just trying to figure out if I should get something that looks nice for my room for my aunt. I love the Casaluna line at Target. They just have really pretty like linen sheets and quilts and stuff. Um, like I said, that's the knit blanket I have on top of my bed. I'm just trying to figure out if I should get anything else. I am at my house now cleaning out my closet and um, there's a lot of things in here that just like bring back so many memories because I would just put everything at the top like let me show you guys some of the stuff so these are the first pair of headphones I had um the beads when these were like super popular in purple and I don't think they're even in here this is so dusty I think this is just a box um and then I have my yearbook crazy do they even do yearbooks anymore? I guess they do, but like, let me see if I can find myself. Okay, this was 11th grade. Comment down below if you can spot me. I don't know why I didn't straighten my hair considering how much I used to straighten my hair for school. I'm very surprised I didn't straighten my hair here. This is my friend Zainab. This is my friend Taylor. We were roommates in college. <clears throat> I will... Yeah, I'm fine. Oh. <laughs> then my friend Allie made me this scrapbook of all of our pictures together. Oh my god, this is so funny. She put a bunch of pandas on them because when I was in high school, a lot of my friends called me panda. And I used to collect panda bears. So weird to look back on all of this stuff. <laughs> oh my goodness. Here are a few of my friends from high school. There was like six of us. We were all really good friends. We did literally everything together. Ooh, we went to a Taylor Swift concert. This was my first my first ever concert that I went to was Taylor Swift for one of my friend's birthdays. Um, her parents took all of us and we had really good seats. That was a fun, really fun day. I found my letterman in this box. I'm not going to take it out, but I'm pretty sure this was like graduation. Yeah, graduation stuff. My letterman, little graduation gown. I'm just going to keep it in here and then I'll put like trophies I have dance trophies I'll put them in that box I don't remember what this was for oh this was for five years at studio dancing and then some of these were like drill team high school stuff I've got a visitor or a baker I shall say so these are all the sheets and blankets that I need to wash I stripped the bed I have the new pillows here and I cleaned everything like down and then here's what the closet looks like I just kept these, some dresses um, and like two coats and then this stuff I'm actually taking to my apartment so that's coming with me and then I put all the stuff in boxes put it up there so my aunt will have plenty of room to put all of her stuff in here and I wipe down like all the, ca the counters and everything. All right, I am home now. I'm gonna make some food. I just changed into some comfortable clothes. Took all my makeup off because I just need to unwind a little bit. 
Um, I'm gonna make some food and I'm gonna make a HelloFresh meal. I just got a delivery late last night, so it's prepped me for the rest of the week, which is nice. This portion of today's video is sponsored by HelloFresh. If you haven't heard of them, they are a meal kit delivery service and they're so great, so customizable. I love it because you don't have to think about it if you're in like a recipe rut. It's a really good like option to just try new things and everything's like pre-portioned for you <clears throat> so all of the meals come in these little bags and all of the ingredients are pre-measured and it has the exact like amount of ingredients that you'll need so they sent three different ones so they will always send you these recipe cards um which i feel like i've shown y'all a few times but they're always fun to look at because <laughs> You can save these and then um, try to like recreate them. So the recipes they sent over, um, I get the vegetarian options because I like to um, just have the vegetarian option. So if I want to add like my own chicken or shrimp or whatever, I can do that because I never know like what protein I'm going to be in the mood for. So they sent over this black bean soup and let's see this ooh, okay this looks so good salsa verde enchiladas which i am so about this and mohammed's coming this weekend so i told him we're gonna save this to make together and then this one is what i'm gonna make today it's a hoisin sweet potato and mushroom bowl and i'm gonna add shrimp to this because i feel like that would be so good like my mouth's already watering thinking about it so like i said everything's pre-portioned and this is the vegetarian option, but they have, let's see, low calorie, pescatarian, um, so many different options. So literally you can customize it however your dietary needs are. So you can go to hellofresh.com and use my code AmandaAsad12 to get 12 free meals plus free shipping. So I will leave a link in the description box um, if you guys wanna click that, check it out. Um, they also have a ton of things you can add on like if you want any desserts or things like that. So anyways, let's get into making this. I already turned the oven on and yeah, we're gonna open this ingredients. potatoes are in the oven i made some rice it's over there it's ready i did some olive oil in this pan um because i'm gonna do some shrimp i'm gonna add some shrimp to this little bowl so i've got garlic and onion i'll add that i'll grate some ginger and then add the shrimp and then i'll put all the sauce and then add the vegetables to that out they are super crunchy and so good i've had a few and then i added the bell peppers to this so this is done as well i tasted it and it's so good so i'm gonna plate i'm gonna put everything in a bowl i'm gonna top this with some green onions this is like the best part to me we make something similar like this like my family does and putting green onions on top is like the best part then some sesame seeds and sriracha because I'm all about sriracha. Okay, we're gonna taste test. I have to mix everything together. You guys. This is so good. This is my favorite one. 
favorite hello fresh meal i've had so like i said i have a discount code for you guys it's in the description box um so i'll leave it there with the link if you guys want to check it out i'm gonna eat the rest of this mm, how good does that look good morning you guys it's the next day and today i'm in dallas to shoot some pictures um with my photographer anaya let's see if my camera will stay right there i don't usually shoot on wednesdays i usually shoot thursdays but it's raining like the rest of the week actually for the next like 10 days it's raining and i have to get some um pictures done so coming up here taking pictures and then i'm gonna head back home because i'm going to do an orange theory class today i already signed up like two days ago so that's my motivation to like get back home and go work out i have all my stuff in the back i'm only doing two outfits i have this one and then another one oh is this person walking so close to me sorry i can hear you this is why you lock your doors <laughs> like if somebody ever comes over to my window this has happened to me multiple times um i'm very aware of my surroundings for one uh i've always been like that especially living on my own and i'm in downtown dallas and there are a lot of people just walking around you just have to be careful like you never know so you just have to be careful lock your doors keep your windows rolled up because she was telling me like roll down your window and i'm Sorry, I'm, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, we just wrapped up pictures and I ran in and got some food from this restaurant really quickly because I'm hungry. I also got a juice. I haven't eaten anything today, so I got a juice. It has um, apple, celery, no, apple, kale, ginger, spirulina, and one more thing, celery maybe, I don't exactly remember. But I got the juice from Vitality Bowls, and then I got a wrap from this place called Unleavened, Unleavened, whatever, Kitchen. It's a wrap and some fruit. I figured a wrap would be easy to like eat on the way home. Okay, it's a grilled chicken wrap, so we're on the way home. Got about a two hour drive, so. All right, I just got home and changed. I am headed out to Orange Theory, making myself work out. I knew I had a busy day today. I knew I wanted to sign up for a workout class, get it over with, so I'm ready to sweat. And yeah, I'm wearing this <clears throat> um, Gap top. It has a tie right here, a little fold. And then these are my Align leggings and my Nike fly knits that are super old, but I haven't bought workout clothes in a while and i just can't wear any other leggings but lululemon leggings if you guys have tried the align leggings then you know what i'm talking about they're just the best leggings to work out in i cannot say enough good things about them i am at my parents house for dinner they made some biryani chicken and a salad so we are going to dig in and enjoy this hey you guys it's the next day i just got to dallas i am actually picking muhammad up from the airport today so he is landing in a little bit i'm at the mall so i'm gonna run in for a little bit um shop around a little bit and then i'm gonna go get muhammad and we're gonna go to dinner and um he's not landing until like eight o'clock and it's 5 45 right now so i'm gonna go in for a little bit just look around because i want to look at some new like workout clothes and stuff and i have time to kill so why not spend it at the mall and then i'll go pick him up and we don't know where we're gonna go to dinner yet so we'll see we just had dinner at Fireside Pies with some friends and we are headed home. We stopped at Bucky's because I was really craving candy and mom had went in and got it for me. I just wanted like peanut M&Ms so he ran in and got them. Thank you sir. What did you get? Flour, gummies, worms, and peanut Yay! Items. Thank you. Good morning, you guys. It is Saturday. I'm making some coffee, some much needed caffeine today. I'm gonna drink my coffee with a straw since I got my teeth whitened. So, this shall be interesting. Hot coffee with a straw. 
Mohammed's still sleeping, but when he wakes up, we're gonna make some breakfast. Um, we'll probably just do like eggs, avocado toast, something easy. We got back super late last night because we went to dinner with some friends. Okay, yeah, it's really hard to drink something hot with a straw. And Surprise, shoddy. <laughs> Just made some quick breakfast. We have eggs and avocado toast and some turkey bacon. I got Mohammed on avocado toast um, when we were in college and now we both like it. Can't wait to eat this. Oh. Hello. We're here. Okay, we're coming. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. We are headed to dinner with Lena. Well, not Lena. Lena no more are picking us up, but we're all going to dinner together. My family and Mohammed and my aunt from North Carolina. <sighs> we're gonna go um, to my dad's place. It's about a 45 minute drive. So we're headed out the door now. <laughs> Thank you. 